Just in time for spooky season, an iconic local business is staying sweet and expanding to another mid-Michigan city. Thanks for joining us at 530. I'm Elise Ramey. And I'm David Custer. As TV5's Lenita Brooks reports, the new owner of Bay City's St. Laurent Brothers Candy Shop is hoping to keep the classic feel of the store while bringing in some tasty new treats. It is a little bittersweet. Uh, it's part, been part of our fabric of our life for a long time. 38 years to be exact. Steve Fry and his family have been the only owners outside of their original family to own the historic St. Lauren Brothers candy store, but now they are passing the torch. And, uh, my kids have worked here, all the stockholder kids have worked here, lots and lots of kids that we've known. My teacher, my wife was a teacher, so she, we kind of groomed kids through there and got them when they're good ones. And, it will be a little bit different, but uh, we're more than ready. And he says they have found the perfect person to continue the legacy. Jordan Dice, who also recently purchased the Midland Mall, will be taking over from here. I'm very honored. It's a, it's a very long-standing business that has been here in the community for almost 120 years. And uh, I uh, certainly have long memories of it throughout my childhood and many generations of my family do. Including his great-great-grandparents who used to meet at the store for dates in 1919, shortly after the store moved into this location. There's a lot of historical value here. <laughs> And while he'll be keeping most things the same, including the current staff, procedures, and the use of the original century-old equipment, there will be a few additions. We've uh, been considering the ruby chocolate, adding as another variety of chocolate here, and uh, I'd like to open a store also in my mall there in Midland that I own. I think it would be a good location for it. As for Steve, he's excited for retirement, but he says there is one thing he'll miss people. It's been a wonderful experience. We've been blessed. And while he is no longer owner, he'll remain a lifelong customer. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. In Bay City, Lenita Brooks, WNEM TV5.